If you sit all day long, exercise is not enough to undo the damage to your heart. That's according to a new ad advisory from the American Heart Association, which says a sedentary lifestyle is bad for your heart, even if you work out. So how much should we sit? Good question. Here's Heather Brown. Uh, do you mind if I take a seat? Yeah, go for it. 50 years ago, we sat for 26 hours a week. Now we're up to 38. I don't think they watch as much TV as we do. Or we don't do little things like go and make copies. And you don't even have to get up to answer the phone anymore. It's no. just right here. Right here. What's so bad about sitting? Natalie Eichmann is a physician's assistant at HCMC's Golden Valley Clinic. Your heart doesn't pump as hard when you're sitting. Is standing better than sitting, or do you have to be walking around? So standing does have some cardiovascular benefits. I would like to get a standing desk. But adding in the walking with the standing, a good mixture, even with sitting, can be very beneficial. Adults sit six to eight hours a day. Older people sit more, eight and a half to nine and a half. The body's not meant to be that sedentary. Experts say there isn't enough research to give public health recommendations about sitting. So the statement basically says in very simple terms, sit less, move more. But Eichmann has a goal. How much should we be getting up from our desks. So I think it should be every 20 to 30 minutes. That much? Yeah. Really? I'm a millennial, so they, you know, millennials are told to like stand up every 20 minutes or so. Just walking up to the water cooler and back is enough for a little break? Sure, that's sufficient. And really you can do other things too rather than just walking so you can get up and do some arm movements. But researchers say your trip to the printer, it says time to stand up and that's usually when I take my walk, shouldn't be a substitute for exercise, at least 30 minutes five times a week. Even if you're getting up every half hour? Yeah, you, you really still need to incorporate that exercise because it really has good cardiovascular benefits. I have a one year old, so I'm hardly sitting at all. So this is kind of nice for you to be able to just to sit down. Yeah, for a minute, yes, that's great. <laughs> Heather Brown, WCCO 4 News. That's a good point. Well, beyond work, our biggest time spent sitting is while watching television. Eichmann encourages her weight loss patients to get up during commercials, walk upstairs, maybe do some push-ups. If you have a good question for Heather, please email it by going to wcco.com links.